Thanks. So um, when you're a songwriter, you, you write songs about stuff that's happening. And so this is a song I wrote about a guy that I was dating. And he was um, super cute. He was a neuroscientist. He was like smart and funny. Um, and he wooed me by, by telling me about the Seven Sisters. There's like a neuroscience angle to the Seven Sisters, the constellation. Like If you look straight at it, it disappears. But then if you look off to the side, it's like brighter and it's because of your um like the rods and cones in your eyes and the way your brain processes light so i was like wow <laughs> <laughs> so i kind of fell for him but then um but then it turned out he was also alcoholic and newly divorced and so he was like a he had so much baggage he was like a walking luggage store <laughs> and so so it didn't work out and it hasn't break up with him about um, five months in. It just became clear that it wasn't going to work. Um, but when I broke up with him, I was, I was sort of bummed out about it because I also really liked him. So I wrote this song to make myself feel a little bit better. It's like a breakup song. Like a song even though I did the breaking up, it was, it was still a song for me to feel better. But then, like, I'd written about half of the song now, and then I suddenly felt fine. Which is like, I'm actually already over him. <laughs> and then, as a songwriter, that's problematic. You're like, oh no, but I still have to finish the song. So, um, so the song, I, I made it, I, made, I finished it anyway. So, so. The first half is way more authentic. <laughs> I really felt it the first half. And then I recovered. <laughs> it's called Half Lace. Thank you. 